to my channel if you are new welcome make sure you thumbs up the video subscribe hit that bell notification so you don't miss any uploads and let's get right into this video so in today's video we're going to be talking all about notorium skincare one of you guys reached out to me and asked me please go over the skincare products that i did reviews on and notorium and if i still use those particular products he said because there are not a lot of videos on notorium on youtube um, or there's not a lot of people talking about the products i will definitely do that for you guys today just going over the products that I have mentioned that I picked up before and if I am still using those products today. But let's go ahead and get into this first product. The first product that I picked up by Notorium guys was the Niacinamide Cleansing Gel A 3%. This is Niacinamide 3% plus Hyaluronic Acid and Vitamin C. I'm not gonna touch, stay on these too long because I do have individual videos or like a full video reviewing each product. So if you wanna check that out, I will link that below or I'll put it up here and just click the link but stay here first and watch this video. And um, I'll, it kind of goes into more depth about them, but I do still use this product, you guys. Number one, niacinamide. My skin loves niacinamide. If you're looking to brighten the skin, declog your pores, niacinamide is great for that. Of course, vitamin C is great for brightening the skin. Also, hyaluronic acid just implements that moisture back into our skin. As I've said before, as I've probably said a million times on here, our body does produce hyaluronic acid. When you're using skincare products that have hyaluronic acid or that is a hyaluronic acid serum, it does implement the moisture and replenish the skin also. So those are great products to look for to use a serum by itself with hyaluronic acid or a cleanser or um, a moisturizer or something like that. It says this cleanser leaves the skin feeling soft, smoother, and more balanced, can be used dry or damp. You also can use this as a mask if you place it on your skin. I think for five minutes, you can use it as a mask also. I've done that a few times, but this really lathers up very nicely and it really cleanses my skin without stripping my skin. My skin feels nice and cleansed, but it doesn't feel like I'm stripped away the moisture. It just has a nice lather. It doesn't have a scent to it. You guys, my husband uses this cleanser. Um, <laughs> I just use two pumps. A little bit goes a long way. I massage into the hands add water now it emulsifies more once you add water do double cleanse with this if i'm even if i'm not double cleansing with a um, balm or an oil so i'll go with my first cleanse just cleanse for 60 seconds rinse it away and then i'll go with my second cleanse i do that morning and night just because i feel like that is what my skin needs. I am acne prone. I really had any breakouts lately, fingers crossed. But I'm acne prone, so I try to use products that are going to help me with that and also keep things at bay. Use the product as it needs to be used for my skin, if that makes sense. It's so good, y'all have to get your hands on it. This is my second bottle of this. I purchased it on my own. I actually purchased it from Target. It is sold in Target and Notorium has its website. Vegan free brand, also you guys, cruelty free, so if you're into that, you definitely, may, you definitely want to go ahead and pick this up. But again, I will link the video below where I really go into depth and show you guys how I use this product. But this is a product by Notorium that I mentioned to you guys a month ago that I still use now today. Another product that I mentioned to you guys is the Azalic Topical Acid 10%. But it has niacinamide and vitamin C. Again, those two ingredients are so good for the skin. Oh my gosh, you guys, I can't even stress it enough. When I go, when I would go see my esthetician, I would ask her if there is a product in my skincare routine or an ingredient in my skincare routine that I should be using every day based on me seeing you every four weeks, based on you knowing my skin, what product or what ingredient should I have? And she told me it's Zalic acid. You need to have that in your skincare routine, hands down. So they, I did, I was using the Jan Marini, um, what is it? bio clear i still have that it's just a stronger solution it's more of like a salon solution it's very bougie i still have that one but this is definitely the dupe for that phthalic acid is amazing for acne prone skin it gives you a nice clear look to the skin also it really just clears up the redness and i absolutely love that if i have a breakout coming and let's say that i released it 
I will go ahead and wash my face and then I'll go ahead and apply my azelaic acid and it just really heals my skin. And I love using this at night because your skin heals at night. You have your cell turnover, but I love using this at night. I do use this in the morning, every other morning, not every morning, but I do love using this at night just because I feel like it's, I'm giving my skin like a little treatment. Um, but it's really good if you guys want to try it. It does have a syringe on it as well. If you guys can see that again, I have a video on this showing you guys how I use it. The next item that I still use by Notorium, I'm out of it. It is the Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I went through that fast. I mean, I was doing this with the bottle. Like, is there more? Where did it go? Because I used the crap out of it. So I'll put a little picture up right here. I also have a video again, if you guys want to check it out, but, um, I used the crap out of that acid. I do need to get another one. When I went to purchase it at Target, it was sold out. So I need to go ahead and replenish that one. I'm using the one by Verse right now, which is just as good, but that one, it just, Mm, it soaks into the skin. It, it's like it's giving my skin a drink of water. It's not sticky. And when I place it on my skin, the um, dry down, it doesn't feel tacky. It just feels like I have nothing on my skin. And then I go in with my moisturizer. It like preps my skin for my moisturizer and my other products to come. And I love the hyaluronic acid. So you guys have to definitely give it a try. It's the same packaging as this one. It just has the hyaluronic acid. I love the packaging too, because it's really cute. And very vanity, uh, very vanity fair. Like you could definitely set this on your vanity or set this on your counter in the bathroom. Okay, since I'm doing this video, I do want to mention the two products that I have added from Notorium, which are the Niacinamide Serum 12% plus Zinc 2%. Again, if you guys are acne prone, zinc is great for the skin. You may find zinc in some of your um, SPF, like your sunscreen also. And then next is the Notorium Plant Ceramide Rich Moisture Cream. Amazing. You guys, I have not done a full in-depth review on these products, on these two, but I am going to do that, especially if you guys want me to let me know in the comments. I did do a reel on this, so it's like a mini review on my Instagram if you're not following me. Follow me there. Haven't used this niacinamide serum yet, but I have a feeling that my skin is going to love it. It does have a pump, which I love because there's no cross-contamination. If you're trying to implement a niacinamide in your skincare routine, I would say go ahead and do it. Use niacinamide after you cleanse the skin. You would go in with your niacinamide after your skin is completely clean. Um, so these two, like I said, I just started using these. I have been using the crap out of this. My husband used this too. He just goes in my little drawer, y'all, and whatever I use, he uses. But this one is going to be a staple because the way that my skin feels after using it, I use it morning and night. It just feels amazing. The first night that I used it, I was so excited about it because I woke up and my skin felt just beautiful. It felt, looking at it, I'm like, wow, this really kept my skin moisturized throughout the night. There have been products that I have used before that feel good, my skin feels moisturized and hydrated when I'm placing it, but then when I wake up the next morning, my skin feels dry, like it just sucked it all up. It makes me feel like I have dry skin when it does that, but it's just the product and whatever the product has in it, it's just not enough for me. But this right here, this cream is the magic in a jar, especially for the cooler months. I will not use this in the summer because it is rich, it really is rich and heavy, so I wouldn't use it in the summer, but for the winter time, like right now, my skin craves this moisturizer, so I'll definitely have this in heavy rotation. And if you guys wanted me to do a more in-depth video on these two, let me know. I do use, or did use the lip balm. My daughter stole it, she has it now. It's really good, they have all, a lot of different um, scents. I'll link all this stuff down below. I'll link other products as well. You guys just have to check them out, they're really good. If I would say, try something like one thing for the first time definitely the cleanser because you have to cleanse your skin every day anyway so definitely give the cleanser a try let me know how you guys like it and what you like about it if you use anything different than what i've mentioned and you like it it's worked great for you let me know and i'll try to pick it up and try it out for myself but that is going to complete this video i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope it was helpful when you do go to make your purchases make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up subscribe hit that bell notification so you don't miss any uploads and i will see you guys in the next video bye